Just recently, the tech world was shaken up by the sight of this humanoid robot, the figure 1.0 by OpenAI. For a long time, the world has been waiting for this moment. A robot that could distinguish objects, analyze scenarios, and respond and react accordingly. But what is currently happening with AI and its progress? How did we get from the earliest computers to these super machines? Join us as we take a closer look at combining artificial intelligence with the power of quantum computing. Quantum computing is an emerging revolution that promises to fundamentally change the way we interact with technology. To understand its impact, it's necessary to understand the basic concepts of not only what it is, but also its potential. Since the early days of computing, we've witnessed an amazing evolution from gigantic machines that took up entire rooms to devices that fit comfortably in our pockets. From the end of the era of vacuum tubes, which powered computers and made them so large, to the advent of transistors, which were small and helped shrink the size of the devices. But there's a physical limit to the miniaturization of components, the size of an atom. Basically, you can't make something smaller than that. Enter quantum computing. Quantum physics, which governs the subatomic world, challenges our traditional notions of reality. Concepts like superposition, where a particle can exist in multiple states at once, and entanglement, where particles can influence each other regardless of distance, are just the beginning of this new era. Imagine sending a file from point A to point B instantly, because distance doesn't exist for atoms. This leads us to quantum bits, or qubits, which aren't limited to binary values of zero and one, but can exist in a superposition of both states, opening the doors to unparalleled computing power. This means that qubits can be both zero and one at the same time, because that's how the quantum world works. Using quantum principles such as superposition and entanglement, these machines can perform millions of operations simultaneously, making them potentially exponentially faster than their classical counterparts. But quantum computing isn't just an improvement on classical computing. It's a paradigm shift, because its logic gates and the way it processes information are radically different from conventional computers. Programming for these machines requires a completely new approach, Although, there are some development kits like CERT, SKIT, and SHARE that ease the transition for traditional programmers. Over the years, we've seen significant progress in this area, from the early theoretical models of the 1980s to the emergence of the first commercial quantum computers in the 21st century. It's been quite a journey. Companies like IBM, Google and Microsoft are leading the charge to unlock the potential of this breakthrough technology. As quantum computing evolves, it raises profound questions about information security and the limits of conventional computing. Could future quantum devices easily break any security system? The answer is yes and no. A quantum hacker obviously can break a traditional security system. But when we have quantum tech smartphones, there will be quantum security systems, so there won't be any problems. At present, artificial intelligence is all the rage. It has been popularized and has gained enormous acceptance and influence. It has captured the attention of many individuals, groups, and organizations to the extent that it is even predicted to eliminate millions of jobs worldwide. But what exactly is artificial intelligence, and how does it work? Broadly speaking, Artificial intelligence is the ability of machines, such as computers, to perform tasks that typically require human intelligence. However, there are different interpretations of what this artificial intelligence should be. Initially, it was thought that machines should fully emulate human intelligence. Over time, however, this view has evolved. And we now understand that AI can take many forms and doesn't necessarily have to mimic human intelligence exactly. So what tasks can these intelligent machines perform? Well, for starters, they can perform extremely complex calculations quickly and efficiently. This is because computers can process large amounts of data and perform mathematical operations in a matter of seconds. In addition, 
machines can remember large amounts of information and use it to make informed decisions. This is particularly useful in applications such as games, where algorithms can learn from past experience and improve their performance over time. However, there are aspects of human intelligence that are still beyond the reach of AI, such as the ability to learn flexibly, be creative, or have self-awareness. Although these abilities remain difficult to replicate in machines, researchers are working to develop algorithms that can mimic them to some extent. One of the most exciting areas of AI is machine learning, a technique that allows algorithms to learn from data and improve their performance over time. For example, machine learning algorithms can detect patterns in large datasets and use this information to make predictions or decisions. There are several types of machine learning algorithms, including supervised, unsupervised, and reinforcement learning. Each of these approaches has its own applications and uses different techniques to learn from data. With all this, you now have a deeper understanding of artificial intelligence. Now, how about we take a look at the potential that both have when combined? The fusion of quantum computing and artificial intelligence is a combination that could truly spark a technological revolution pushing the boundaries of capability and efficiency. Imagine a future where artificial intelligence not only performs extremely complex calculations quickly, but also harnesses the full potential of quantum computing to perform millions of operations simultaneously, exponentially faster than conventional computers. Quantum computing, with its principles of superposition and entanglement, allows quantum bits, or qubits, to exist in a superposition of states, meaning they can represent both zero and one at the same time. This concept has been discussed before, but never in the context of artificial intelligence, which typically operates in binary code. But now, imagine it programmed with a quantum language. Imagine an artificial intelligence that can learn faster and more flexibly thanks to the massive processing power of quantum computing. These AIs could analyze vast amounts of data and extract patterns and correlations in ways never before imagined. They could also continuously adapt and improve their performance over time, thanks to machine learning algorithms running in quantum environments. With the convergence of quantum computing and artificial intelligence, we could see humanity's fastest advances in a wide range of fields, from medicine and biotechnology to engineering and material science. Computational simulations and modeling, currently too complex for conventional computers, could be performed in seconds on an AI-powered quantum machine. In addition, information security could benefit greatly from this combination. AI could develop some sophisticated encryption and security algorithms capable of withstanding even the most advanced attacks from future quantum devices. This would ensure the protection of sensitive and private information in an increasingly digital world. We're talking about one of the most significant systems ever seen, with enormous potential. The convergence of quantum computing and artificial intelligence promises a quite remarkable future, with incredibly interesting possibilities, capable of performing computation and analysis at speeds and scales we have never seen before. These technologies could radically change the way we interact with technology and open up new frontiers of knowledge exploration and innovation. If you enjoyed the video, don't forget to like and subscribe to the Artificial Intel channel. And see you next time.